Hi guys, welcome to my skincare routine. I have filmed one of my skincare routine last year and it's changed quite a bit since then. And I wanna make another video more updated now of what I do now and how I take care of my skin in the morning and in the evening. My nighttime skincare routine uh, will be in another video because I want to separate both of them. They're a little bit different. And I want to show you guys that it's actually really easy and just show you what I do. So I just got out of the shower. I always end up with a cold shower. This morning before going into the shower, I did an exercise and my skin was feeling very dry. So I just rinsed it with some water and did a face mask. I usually do that in the evening, so I'm not gonna share more about that, but just to be real. So I didn't do it this morning because I wanted to show it to you guys and I wanted to show it here, but usually I do this in the shower. This is a natural sponge. I like to use that in the shower, so I'll use that either in the morning or in the evening. And how it works is you just wash your face with it. And for me, I don't feel like it necessarily washes my face very deeply, like if you would, were gonna about to do it with a cleanser. What I find is that it's very calming and gentle and very um, soothing. It's like a little massage for your skin. I have been using this Green Dimension Foaming Cleanser. It's also a makeup remover and you use it just a little bit on wet skin. So usually I'll also cleanse while I'm in the shower. Just use a little bit. It's this um, light pinkish color and it's very jelly and it's very nice on the skin. What I like about this cleanser is that it is quite thick, very jelly and it doesn't leave my skin super dry and it doesn't foam too much like a regular cleanser. It's more like a gel and it feels very hydrating and refreshing to the skin, which I really like. So I've been really liking this one. This is from the brand Elysia and this was gifted to me from my neighbor. She has a skincare company and she's been gifting me and my family skincare for the longest time. It's all produced and made in Switzerland and it's made out of natural ingredients. And then finally, um, it's also not tested on animals. So that's really, really good. And then I'll just rinse my face. And then when I dry it, and I like to dab the towel onto my skin and not rub it. So much better for your skin. Uh, once I've cleansed, I sometimes use a toner. That's not something I use every day. But I'm still gonna show you. Um, I have two toners. I have this one from Elena, which is also from my neighbor. It contains some rose extract and also a cucumber extract. So it has some really nice ingredients. It's very fresh, um, but it is still a very complicated product. It does contain a lot of ingredients and I like to, even if it's natural products, I like to stick to things that are a little bit more simple. And then I also have this one from uh, Dr. Oshka which was gifted to me while I was in Berlin. Um, this one I really like. It's also natural cosmetic. Um, I really like because it is a spray. This is also just a sample. What I like about this, it, you can just spray it onto your face like this. And I like to use it also to set makeup. And this one, if I choose to use this one, um, I'll just use it on a reusable cotton pad. I have these cotton pad to, you know, not use regular pads and uh, you can just wash them. So I'll use that if I choose to use this one since this one is not a spray. Another thing that I've started using is being serums. I really, really love serums. They have really not changed my life because it, I can't say that my skin is completely transformed since using them, but I really think they're a 
good addition to a skincare routine, although some people might argue that it is a sort of superfood for your skin, and I agree, but personally I've really liked including serums into my skincare. I feel like my skin has really been loving it. So I've received this serum from Oliveda. It's a natural cosmetic and it's made out of olive leaf extract. I really like this serum. Not using it anymore because I just finished it and ran out of it. However, I would highly recommend this. I've really been using it for maybe six months, the last six months I've been using it and I really really like it. Otherwise now I've been using this Bio Serum from Elena, which is also from my neighbor and it's also a glass bottle which I really like. I'll just use a pump of this. I just put it all over my hands and then I'll just dab it onto my skin. I find that it does absorb better this way than just rubbing it. What I like about serums is that it gives your skin this instant sort of sh glow. It shines a little bit and it makes your skin more uh, plump, which I really, really like. For moisturizer, I have two moisturizers. I have, again, one from Oliveira, which I'm running out. Uh, pretty much at the same time as I'm running out of the serum. Really like this one. However, it does contain uh, beeswax. And then I have this uh, moisturizer from Eleanor, which is the Gentle Moisturizing Protective Cream. And this one is definitely a little more liquid than the olive-based one, but it also is a bit more refreshing to the skin, which I also like. And I have the little spatula so I don't put my fingers in there. This is also glass container, which is really nice. One other addition that I've had in my skincare is this Oliveira eye cream, uh, which I received also with the serum moisturizer. However, this one I've barely been using. It's still quite full. I thought, okay, let's just use it once in a while. I do use it and it's very nice to use it. So I just take a little bit, you don't need so much, it's just for your under eye and then I just dab it underneath my eyes for my lips I use this organic she butter it's just 100% she butter and I just really like using that on my lips I just find it very hydrating, it's really thick but that's the nice thing about it is that it stays on for quite a while and that's it! That's what I do for my skincare routine. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will link all the products that I am able to find online down below. If you have any questions, let me know anytime and I'll see you very soon. Bye.